Hi everyone and welcome to Nico's Kitchen's Fast Food. Today I'm going to give you a dish that you can make in under 15 minutes. How fast is that? And best of all, it's super healthy. So, let's get started. He's got budget meals Monday, what you want Wednesday, fast food Friday, what else could he share? It's Nico's Kitchen where satisfying meals are prepared. So guys, the first thing that we're gonna to do to get started on our swordfish with Thai dressing is make our dressing. So just into a large bowl, I've got some fresh mint here and I've just chopped it up finely and I'm just gonna add that in. I've also got some fresh coriander or cilantro leaves that I, again, I've just chopped up finely and just adding to the bowl. And I'm also gonna be adding in some lemongrass. Now make sure the lemongrass, you peel back the hard parts of the skin because they're very bitter and very chewy. You just want the inner part of that lemongrass. And again, I've just chopped it up finely. And now I'm gonna be adding in some lime juice. And I love limes, I really do. They just add this beautiful citrus flavor to the dressing. And lastly, I'm gonna be using a sweet chili sauce and I love the flavor of this. It just gives this dressing such a beautiful chili flavor, but also a sweetness to counteract with that tartness of the lime. And we're just gonna give this a quick mix through and the smell of these flavors is just extraordinary. It's such a beautiful, fresh dressing to put together in less than 30 seconds. So that's all we have to do with our dressing. Now I'm gonna put it aside and we're gonna get started cooking on our swordfish. Now for cooking our swordfish, I'm gonna be doing it on a griddle pan, but if you don't have one, you could do this outside on the barbecue or just do it in a normal flat pan. And I'm just going to be putting over some grape seed oil over the pan, get it nicely coated. We're gonna be using some swordfish. Now, I love swordfish. I think it's really underused. I love the flavor of it. You can use any fish for this recipe that you want to, but if you can get your hands on some swordfish, give this recipe a try. And our swordfish here, I've just seasoned it with some salt and pepper. So I'm just gonna be placing our swordfish down onto the grill pan, nice and hot. Now, this will not take that long to cook. It's only gonna take about two and a half to three minutes each side. So we've cooked our fish. I'm just serving this up with a very easy mixed salad. And I'm going to be putting over our dressing that we made before just on top of the fish. And just to finish off with a slice of lime on the side. Okay, so let's get stuck into this, shall we? The flavors, the fresh herbs, that swordfish has a wonderful flavor. That is fast food and it's so good for you. All the ingredients are below for this recipe in the description. I'll see you this Sunday for a slow cooker Sunday recipe. So until then, you take care.